Get wrecked, dude. <laughs> I, I randomly double jumped into the barrel. Oh, uh, I've done that many times. <laughs> yes. That was terrible. How does that work? There's a few different ones. I'm actually doing one of two double jumps. Like the easy one is as soon as you land, you press B and A, and then like let go, and you'll get like a tiny lift, and then you can jump out of that. There is a bigger one you can do, where there's like a three frame window with no difference in animations, where if you press uh, B and A, it stores like a crazy high double jump. Huh. So like, that's a regular one, and one. There's a regular one, I guess it's short yeah. hop double jump, true double jump, omega double jump. It's really cool until you have to do it to beat the level or you lose the run. So. Yeah, it's just one of those things that really isn't a good visual cue for the good one. If you want to beat Twig's world record, you really just got to do it by feel. See, like, it's weird, dude, because I scroll the camera way differently than you do. Or are we really doing a practice race? No. <laughs> no, we're just... I'm good whenever. Okay. Me, me too. Alright. I guess we're good. Rip. You want me to reset again? Yeah, yeah. Good luck. Set. For some reason, I just like went to look at that TV. <laughs> <laughs> like I was playing on it. Oh my Just you give us a countdown. Right. Three, two, one, go. All right. Let's do it. We can change the microphone how it's handled. Or uh, no, it's been like that the whole time. Oh, it's I been see. picking okay. up well enough that. <laughs> Dude, you're a believer in jumping to keep speed there. I'm a believer in uh, <laughs> rolling like an idiot. So yeah, this is Donkey 2, uh, actually it's Donald Land 2. <laughs> Rip, dude! Oh, that was so close. <laughs> I threw it too fucking high and it... Oh, that was scary. But yeah, so, just kind of monkeys uh, who throw each other around, you hold Y and press B and win the game. Donkeys, yeah. Donkeys, Donalds. monkeys, Donalds. Donalds. This is like one of the stupid tricks in the game. We'll see who doesn't get it. Oh, I got it. Sweet. I missed it. Oh, well, that's kind of bad. <laughs> that trick's actually really precise. Um, that's like the worst way I could have missed it. I got to freeze you the water. Unload it or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> I know. <laughs> that sucks. Yes. Uh, don't worry, Crow will catch you right back up. Uh, <laughs> so this is like the, I guess like the most RNG portion of the game, realistically. Crow throws fake eggs, and uh, he can give you as many as he feels like. A good guy. Came over here talking pretty good. Very staggered cookie. Got three. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Well, GG. <laughs> yeah. Oh. It's actually faster for him to die there, probably. <laughs> Yeah, it's For about the same time loss, really. Losing the Kong is really bad here because you can't do the long warp in the next level. I'll 
this, this sticker brush shit. Oh, Cam's claim is the real DKC2 car. <laughs> it is good. That was a good roll. So that uh, trick I did where I did like a jump right there is the big boy. Saves a decent amount of time, but it's just timing when you jump off the hook. And it gets you to the warp barrel faster. I think I've ever seen you actually get that. <laughs> <laughs> I practiced it a lot recently because I'm bad at it. Uh, the level of garrisons at right now is basically the only one where it has an unavoidable goal. So we have to lose time there. Oh my god, dude. What? I missed the fucking hook. <laughs> so that's really Christmas stupid. <laughs> so basically, you just do a damage boost there to grab that hook, and I missed it. It was bad. That trick's really, really easy. So I'm setting up a trick called Lava Jump right now. That is stupid. Shout out to Twig. Oh, I got it. Woo. So if you miss that, it's really, really bad. And it's not hard to make it all, so. For all the donkey fans out there, floating diddy. <laughs> cool. <laughs> so, uh, basically, the game actually starts in Crim Key. Everything else should be free. Oops. Uh, now for the game starting in Cream Key, uh, I think we both kind of got fucked a little bit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So ditching Rambi there just yeah. saves some time. Oh, the freeze on the game Yeah. Across the point. And it spawns a DK coin. So that uh, team up throw I just did in that barrel loads another kind of big jump to skip uh, this portion of the level here. If I get it. Oh, I got it, okay. Missed the G. So if you miss that and you take the barrel, you lose about seven seconds. And probably the hardest level in the game, Thunder Skellion. Uh, <laughs> Other than Webwoods.
Uh, we're both playing on Japanese version as well because we don't want to jump over two Bs later in the game. That's essentially the only reason now with uh, Bramble Wrong Warp. Ah, fuck. Oh, this is one of those rare Japanese versions of the slightly easier game. Yeah, yeah, very, very slightly. There's literally one B. <laughs> one, well, one extra that's, that's the same. Okay, so it's just like Ninja Gaiden, where it's just like one dumb thing. It's just like well, before thing. when we did uh, Bramble Scramble like the normal way, um, it saved a lot. Of the B maze at the end was much shorter. Yeah. How did that? I just wonder how that actually happens. They really review the whole game. And see <laughs> this one thing need to rebalance. Like, yeah. uh, it's definitely a lot harder at the end of Bramble Scramble if you play it casually. An RPC, dude. <laughs> Somebody's fucking porking or something. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sweet. Oh, uh, GG. Crockhead's like the first real level in the game. Like when you practice and you want to decide to run donkey, learn crockhead, and then if you hate the game, then quit. <laughs> and uh, in rattle battle here, the hitboxes are notoriously bad. Nice. Hey, you both look at that stage really well. Like that, you barely clip the side of that barrel and land on the, the croc. It was like maybe the third to last. Yeah, round. it's really scary. Yeah. There's a lot of really scary moments. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that's really easy to mess up in that level just by like letting go of Y or <laughs> I don't know. That level is pretty stupid. Oh shit. Okay. I had to back out there. I was definitely gonna lose a con. And there's probably gonna be variations in each level. Like if you're watching me or Gary. Just depending on like little movements or little camera scrolls or whatever. Like we're doing the same things in most instances, but like we just do them a little bit differently for what you're used to or how you move the camera. Scrap okay. hats. Oh fuck, dude. GG, catch up. <laughs> Still <ahead of> me. <laughs> <sighs> so I have to have uh, both Kongs there. So Diddy, or Diddy, you're Diddy now apparently. Gary caught up a little bit there. Or oh, past me. Race. Um, Oh my fucking god, dude. Rip. That sucks. Just like that. So yeah, I just lost a shit ton of time right there. Fortunately or unfortunately, this game is very brutal. <laughs> so, I mean, this doesn't really mean a whole lot right no, now. No, yeah, it's definitely... It's, could go either way. Oh my god, dude, please. So the reason we have to do this extremely swaggy jump, other than to look cool, is uh, to make sure the water doesn't load, so that we can do the wrong work. most people's favorite song in this game, even though it's absolutely not the best. Oh, I got it. Oh, shit. Nice. Nice. Oh, guys, this is, uh, I remember this song. This is my favorite. <laughs> 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 Could be like a <laughs> 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 new flashback. Every song is my favorite. 
<laughs> oh my god, dude, I just did that. I got lost in the maze, personally. I just missed, like, every quick shot. Missed Wiggle. That trick is really hard, especially like, I don't know, it's not really that far into the run, but that trick is frustrating. If you miss it, there's an alternate route you can take, but... You can see just Gary and I are both doing the same thing. We're both doing the Cujo quick kill, but we scroll the camera differently. It doesn't matter, but... Backwards, it's kind of hard. Really uh, intricate timing. But that was well, that guarantee you like as early as possible. Yeah. This yeah, it's like a, a second a and a half, right? <laughs> Over yeah, like something really small, and if you miss once, you lose 15 seconds. But it's worth it. Worth. And we actually use Dixie's breathing to see when to move. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be a pussy and play it safe here. I got every cycle, but <laughs> just play it safe. Uh oh. What we spill? Uh oh. Internet all you. All the smoke. Drop your Doritos. <laughs> <laughs> so the trick Gary just did is called Scrolly Scroll, and basically you jump off of Squitter and uh, land directly on the hook and it forces the screen to scroll to the right and go fast. Yeah, the game really doesn't like it when you're on a hook and Squitter at the same time. <laughs> uh, if you miss the jump though, it's pretty bad for you. Oh my god, dude, that was fucking terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, when you do the scrolly scroll, you damage boost off that bee and it jumps you up to that honey and it's a little bit faster. Yeah. <laughs> One of many ways to store a super jump. The thing is though, is like, it doesn't even matter until Bramble. <laughs> like, it doesn't even matter. There's some tricks you can do in this level that save you some frames and <clears throat> a little bit of time. Like landing on the next card as soon as possible. Yeah, landing on the card as soon as possible, and then the blue mosquitoes shoutouts. Uh, you can bounce off of them in a way that you can like do mosquito skips and um, save a little bit of time. Chat is stupid right now. <laughs> oh shit, did they hear that joke? Yeah, they were just uh, Doritos. Oh, oh god. There was only one of that, but then it's like. <laughs> I thought this guy's name was Doritos. <laughs> <laughs> it looked like it. I was like, it's Doritos. Oh. Yeah, that's just Did you miss the barrel? I didn't get a hut. 
Uh, landed on the wrong place. <laughs> a little too far to the right. Yeah. No swag trip today. That's actually brand new. So it's like, yeah. what, like two months old maybe? Yeah. I just woke up and all of a sudden a minute got cut off the game. Shout out to Gary for the visual cue for that like two days ago. <laughs> oh, did I do the same thing you did? I thought I did. Oh, Bramble Shame. Wave dash into Bramble Shame. <laughs> If I miss this again, I'll just do it regular for because whatever. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Through too late. Through too early, through too late. Now I'll just go right in the middle and be perfect. I don't remember that level hauling so much ass. Is that it's because you went back and grabbed something over the middle at the beginning. Yeah, there's like a speed boost that you go backwards and... Oh my fucking god, dude. You're supposed to release it at like the peak of your jump. It's <laughs> actually like a two frame. No, yeah, it's two frames, but it's the setup is super consistent. I'm just jumping too early off the bramble. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, I haven't missed this trick this many times in a row since the day I was learning it. So I, my IDs are weird because I do a, like, I'm pretty sure I do a different setup than everybody. So, and I don't know these things until Garrison points them out. <laughs> but, yeah, that was really bad. What was that, like 20, 20, 50 or something? That should be about three, yeah, that should be about four minutes faster. <laughs> like when we're getting the work there. I don't know, there's a lot of game left. But about mine? Yeah. I'm sure, like, that, what? <laughs> I'm sure they are, dude. I'm, I don't think that anybody else ever gets it to spawn that barrel to spawn right there like that. I don't know what is weird about the IDs when I do them, but I don't know. It feels right. Obviously, it doesn't work that well. <laughs> Like honestly, Crimland is not too bad. Mudhole and Bramble have some skeptical stuff you can do, obviously, but Gloomy Gulch is kind of <laughs> like the great equalizer for every runner, I think. Because I'm terrible at Gloomy Gulch. Oh my 
I fucking rip, dude. I think we died. Oh, no, really? okay. Did you miss the roll? Oh, right uh, no, I died later because I missed the wrong warp and tried to play the level normally. Uh, <laughs> I killed myself on accident. I got you. I really don't know what I'm doing when we get swear. Yeah, the B is ominous, but not that. Yes. <laughs> Dude. Oh, that was terrible. I thought I missed it. So bad. Please, E. Shh. Ah! <laughs> That's what I get for trying something I'm not used to. <laughs> Were you doing that setup? <laughs> yeah, without ever practicing it once. <laughs> like, okay, so literally right before the race, we were, oh my god, we were talking about stuff in the practice room, and I showed Gary my setup for this fight, and apparently that was what happened. <laughs> Strats. Everything I do now is pretty much what I've done for months. Dude, I'm, I live in 2013 when it comes to this game. I've still got a lot of 2011 showing. <laughs> Actually, it feels like it slowed down for a couple of years, yeah. even though people were actively playing. They just kind of had like a renaissance of frame savers and the new wrong work. There's a lot of people that like run this game. The community seems like it's probably not that active, um, but like the IRC is always pretty happening, I guess, like, even if it's not about Donkey. But uh, the community itself is I'm talking about strats, but whether they get implemented or not is a different thing, but like the Bramble Sc oh, what dude? Apparently my setup's not that good, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that worked for me the second time. But like, Klosti found that wrong warp is, like he's explained it to people like fucking around and jumping. Like, we knew, or they knew, I didn't know. <laughs> they knew about like, uh, being able to get an invis barrel or beetle bash off of the bramble like that and then it just came down to actually figuring out a setup for it. It's really funny because the only reason it was down is because Klosti had a VOD on Twitch that <laughs> said nice wrong work but it wasn't referring to that particular stage but the thumbnail was wrong. So that they, he just went and screwed around after that and he found it because he was inspired to mess with that level again. Yeah, there's probably, like in every level aside from like the minecart levels, there's variations of pretty much every area in the entire level. And like Garrison and I do the same strats, but our setups are different or... Where, but every level is like that and you can watch like five runners and they all do the same stuff, but it's all completely different. <laughs> That probably doesn't make sense unless you run the game, but it's really weird. It's like a unique game in the sense that you can kind of have your own style, kind of like Yoshi's Island. <clears throat> or you know, like, certain people that use certain strats. You can tell who the player is just like the game. Sometimes. Sometimes, yeah, yeah I mean. Not as much as, like, Super Metroid, but... Oh, yeah. 
Also, Haunted Hall is the last level you'll see this, but uh, you probably saw Garrison also like jumping up and down slopes, and it, it's a little bit faster, like it saves a couple frames. Same thing with jumping through the doors. I forgot to look at the invisible banana again. <laughs> I got hit there too. <laughs> <laughs> That's so, why we play the Japanese one, because there's two Bs right there on the American one, and I never make it out alive. <laughs> uh, Parachute Panic is the hardest auto scroller in video games. Yeah, you're supposed to write all the parrots. <laughs> yeah, that's wow. Last like, five seconds of that. You're blinking this. Yeah, exactly. I'm not supposed to have this. Like I guess it's a good thing I grabbed it. <laughs> Barely seen Dixie Rob. <laughs> Woods and it kills a lot of runs for me. Unfortunately, it's Absolutely. mostly controller issues. That was my um, <laughs> I can say that I played on his controller in the practice room, and I don't even know how he can do that level at all. So it's just about getting like a full height jump and landing on the weapon. Yeah, there's well, there's a couple strats through that level, but it's fastest to go up and two there. And that just reminds me of Mega Man Two, like perfect item one jumps. Yeah, there's a few where you need to get like really, really good height, but for the most part I play it and, like, pretty safe. But yeah, when you take damage, you have a small window where you can actually jump out of it. Yeah, that was my shoulder pad. <laughs> this is why I don't really RTA this game that much. My fault though. I think. Oh fuck, I missed the Diddy headbutt. <laughs> this is the hardest part of this game if you fuck up here. Like I hate doing this shit, absolutely hate it. Okay, we in there. <laughs> that was terrible. Visual cue does absolutely work. Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah, Dixie. <laughs> <laughs> it's like something feels sluggish here. You run slower in the spider if you're Dixie? No, it doesn't affect the spider, just oh. like um, Dixie just moves slower and she has kind of a worse jump. Yeah. I played it way too safe right there. And all those eggs that you destroyed. That was completely my fault. <laughs> I was talking too hard. I'm not used to taking a hit there, so I kind of fucked up everything. Oh my god, dude. Get back. 
No, do that rope climb with Dixie is impossible. I've never made it through there. Uh, there is a, but it's pretty close. Yeah, there have been like training on like who's on me, who's behind. Yeah, like uh, I messed up, Gary messed up, then I messed up. <laughs> and then I messed up. <laughs> Seems like a really good game for racing. Actually. Dude, this game is bad for racing. <laughs> <laughs> good or bad? Thing. Fuck, dude! The same spot again. I'll play next week. You got this. Oh my god, I'm terrible to down here. I'll yeah, the wrong screen. Nice, <laughs> wow. <laughs> Alright, so... Had, uh, had I not been really bad, we'd be super close, but... Uh, Arctic Abyss sucks too. rope section. I'm surprised I didn't get hit there. <laughs> what, dude? Fuck yourself. <laughs> that was my fault, too. That's the thing about, like, shitty rope climbing is it's not, like, RNG or something. It's just me being bad. Reflected found a, a debuffing or I guess a despawning stat for. God, I can't talk. A despawning strat for that puffer. And uh, that was like a mystery for a little while. Claude used to say just press Y. And that was what everybody did. That tends to be the solution for anything wrong in the DK series. Just press Y. Oh, get fucked, dude. Oh my god, dude, turn around. No! Okay. <laughs> that was so fucking bad. What the fuck? <laughs> no, that was my fault completely, dude. Jesus Christ. I've never died like that. I have. Have you? I died a million fucking ways in Arctic Abyss. I thought that I died like every way possible, but... That's what you're supposed to do, but apparently that's too hard.
soup. This level castle crush that Garrison just finished with the the target or the goal at the end coming down for you to hit during uh, the Donkey Kong Country Festival a couple months ago on Reflected's channel. We had a big relay race, and uh, the only time I've ever missed that trick in my entire life was during that when my team was in first place. <laughs> so we ended up getting third. <laughs> But uh, yeah, that was the only time I've ever missed it. Dude, it's the I could teach you, I could tell you what to do, and you could do it right now if you want. <laughs> I'll tell you later. <laughs> nice, dude. That jump is really, really hard. It's pretty precise. Uh, you'll see quite a bit of a different route that Garrison and I do. His is a little faster, but... It's one of the best levels, because there's just so much you can do with it, depending on like safe strats, optimal strats. Seeing this level makes me want to like look at it and see what is happening. You don't want to see Ratley's hitbox because it probably just changes every five frames or something. <laughs> Steroid guy. Steroids now. Oh wow, great. Yeah, it's pretty much GG at this point. I don't know. I'm gonna do stuff I'm not used to here. Oh my fuck, dude. Really? That's really bad. Ugh. I just fucking miss CLC, dude. Get the fuck out of here. I just want to quit really bad. Shout out to the Nocturne. <laughs> yeah, Nocturne is very famous for missing CLC and all of his uh, best friends. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, dude! I did it again. I did the exact same fucking thing. I, you can uh, like go right above them slightly. 
I missed it again. I just I bumped the ceiling. There we go. Woohoo! So dumb. <laughs> So the route, our routes differ quite a bit right there. <laughs> Dude, of course I would do perfect rat lady. Stupid. <laughs> I don't know, I've lost in payroll times actually. If you don't do Blue Diddy, I'm not going to talk to you anymore. I can do one better than that. Uh oh. Oh my god, dude. Rip up in three. Up in five. Sweet. Personal favorite of mine. Up in five. <laughs> All I want now is to have a good screech. Oh, <laughs> see ya. Oh, fuck that, dude, really? Don't die. Oh my god. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me because I was watching my screen. <laughs> <laughs> So uh, I just skipped the race, Gary did the same thing, basically you just fly past Screech. <laughs> now it's now it's anyone's game. Yeah. Well, judging by the fact that I dropped a cycle and then died, probably. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. That's donkey. I don't. I've died at K roll so many times. It's just kind of like a. It's just a really boring. And you, you just pay yeah. <laughs> you you start dicking around with different stuff and then, I don't know. I wish that K. Rule wasn't even here. You just did Screech's Sprint and called it a day. I think we need to get the community to get up on that. We, we probably could. Does that Super Panel Control in the background change to It does in the American version, yeah. I like all that goofy, like, kind of breaking the fourth wall stuff where it doesn't their game with Nintendo and Amazon. Yeah. How this door on the I like the, the dice on the rear view mirror yeah, of the ship. Oh, right. It's far to the right. Yeah, I'll be over there. Uh, you can't always scroll the screen there. Right? See it right there. Uh, you didn't see it, but... Yeah, you can I'll scroll, scroll it here in a second. It's right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, dice. Like, Same side. Oh, uh, just uh, just uh, uh, <laughs> they're like fuzzy dice or something. Yeah, yeah. 
I dropped the same cycle. Oh my god. Uh, you're, ahead, nice. you're ahead, by the way. Wow. <laughs> I'm glad that we're uh, representing the donkey community so well tonight. <laughs> Reflected in Twigger Proud. The Claude, the Claude just turned off his monitor and started playing FFT. I like the tasks people because they like joining the community. It's ridiculous. That's GG. I'm going Blue Diddy, by the way. Ha, ha, ha.